Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can set up your Python environment in just 5 easy steps. Coming up. Hey guys, I'm Abhinav Vyas and this is the starting of my ultimate Python crash course here on YouTube for free. Where I teach you Python assuming that you have zero knowledge about programming itself. And also this channel is intended for pro programming beginners, especially Python beginners who are just starting out on their programming journey. So if you are one of those persons, then subscribe now and turn on the post notification so that you do not miss any of my future uploads. So without wasting any time, let's get into the video. Now the first step is to open up uh, your Chrome or whatever browser you are using and search for a program name anaconda navigator download you can say like that it will search up for you so now the first step was to go to the chrome and search for a program named anaconda navigator now after you did that just click on this installing on windows now all these things will be down in the description link sorry i accidentally just said things so now you see here uh, we have a link as download the anaconda installer just click up here since i'm on windows i'm installing the windows version if you are on linux or something mac you can download it for the operating system as usual since this link is taking too much time to load up and my internet connection is really crappy nowadays i want you to give the knowledge of what are ides ides the full form are integrated development environment now what are these these are the softwares in which you program these are the softwares in which you program just that this is the basic definition anything that can run any programming language it is called ide you get that now let's move back to the video so the site is loaded up you just need to scroll down and down and down and uh, just a little bit of up okay we have an option here as install anaconda so just click on that it will take you to okay so we have a ton of options here we have the windows the mac os and the linux so since i'm using windows uh just depending on your operating system and what bit okay what is the bit type of your operating system just download any of these installer i will be downloading the 64 bit graphical installer but i will not be installing it because i already have it downloaded in my system so that was basically the step two downloading it the step three was installing it which i'm not going to be showing you in this video because because i already have it installed it is like pretty simple okay it is like uh, self-explanatory it is like self-explanatory explanatory so sorry guys it is like self-explanatory okay the fourth step is to open spider okay what is spider spider is an ide what is spider spider is an ide integrated development environment for python and what is the full form of spider scientific python development environment okay this is not related to science here scientific means data science uh, so just give it some time it takes too much time to load up now if you are getting any value out of this video just hit that thumbs up button it will mean the world to me okay so finally after literally one or two minute it loaded up like it took a really long time now it might take a little bit long if you are if you have just downloaded it and running it for the first time just give it a few time okay and if you are finding that uh, this program is really harsh on your cpu and your ram so you can always go with the lighter version of python that is the python standard itself what is that it is called IDLE. I'll link to that in the description so you can also download that if you like. Now let me just introduce you to, to the spider interface. So now this is the coding area. Okay, this is where we code. Okay, this is our coding area. This is where we code and this is called the console. Specifically in, in spider it is called the IPython console. Now I'm not going to be going deeper into IPython but what is a console? Now here uh, you can run python command step by step line by line okay so you don't need to run a full python file if you just want to run a line of code you can always do it on the console you will eventually learn that in this course because this course is for absolutely absolute beginners i am again and again saying that subscribe now and turn on the post notifications okay if you haven't done till now so now that was kind of like a brief introduction now remember that was the step four now what is the step five now step 5 is to start coding so let's just declare some variables and of string data type wait 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 just wait what are variables what are data types i guess you don't know that 
in my next video i'm going to be teaching you what are variables what are data types and all of those stuff so make sure you subscribe and turn on the post notifications so that you do not miss out any of my future uploads and this crash course i'll see you in the next video adios amigos